What's your favorite TV show? Favorite TV show? The OC. Do you have a favorite character from the OC? Yes, I love Adam Brody. Or The Office. Yes, Michael and Jim are awesome. <laughs> What's the most embarrassing song on your MP3 player? The most embarrassing song... Hold on, throw down. Can you do the hoedown tour down? Do you know it? No, I, I know pop and lock and that's about it. <laughs> you can do it for another YouTube video. I, I, I could, but I'm not going to. I can't I'll do it either, don't worry. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite song on the radio right now? Um, probably The Climb is such a good song. I just did a cover of that. And uh, I'm trying to think. I don't listen to the radio that much, uh, but I love The Climb by Miley Cyrus. If you were a crown, what color would you be? Purple or mustard yellow. <laughs> Have you ever been starstruck? Yeah, duh. Um, I was starstruck when I met Ally and AJ. I actually had to perform in front of them, and I was so nervous. Um, but they came up to me afterwards and hugged me, and they were like, you did so good. So um, that was so exciting. And then I met Justin Timberlake, and I could not speak. I was just in awe. <laughs> <laughs> Can you describe yourself in three words? In three words? Um, like all together three words or separate? Separate words. Okay. Um, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. Sometimes I can be crazy and um, like when I'm hanging out with my friends and stuff. And hmm, let's see. I'm, I'm very musical. <laughs> if there were a soundtrack to your life, what song would have to be on it? Probably Chemicals React by Ally and AJ. Um, I definitely listen to that song like every single day, so definitely uh, Chemicals React. Okay. If you were a superhero, what would your name be, what would your power be, and what would your costume look like? <laughs> <laughs> what would my power be? Well, I would like to be invisible. I think that would be great because you can just chime into anything at any time. Um, what would my name be? Super fantastic, uh, savvy, sure. <laughs> um, and wait, what was the other question? The costume. Cost my costume. It would be a mustard yellow and purple uh, jumpsuit with a really cool cape that has a big S on it. <laughs> do you have any <laughs> hidden talents? Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> I can do this with my elbows. Um, a lot of people are like, I can do that too, but it's really hard because everyone thinks they can do it, but they like put their arms here, but you have to put your arms back here and like touch them. And I can jump rope, which isn't really a hidden talent, but I was on like a professional jump rope team when I was in uh, elementary school, and so I can do like double unders and all kinds of cool stuff. Okay. Um, what's something that fans might be surprised to know about you? Hmm. Something. I really like, I don't know if this is something surprising, but I really like um, the Beatles music. Like, I love uh, music from old times like that. And hmm, this isn't really, this isn't very interesting, but I keep all of my um, fortune cookie uh, fortunes in the back of my cell phone, and I have like about 20 or 30 of them, and I keep them in the back of my cell phone. I just have collected them um, since like two years ago, so that's really interesting. <laughs> um, let's see. What's the last CD or album you bought? I think it was Jason Reeves. Um, I got it from the Easter Bunny. <laughs> and uh, he, I don't know if you know, but he wrote a lot of stuff on Colby Calais' album, and he's really talented. I love his stuff. It's more like acoustic, but he has a really good voice. And then uh, the Hannah Montana soundtrack. Do you have any nicknames? Yeah, a lot of people call me Savvy, and um, S-A-V-I, and they call me Savasha. It's like this inside joke between my friend Kaylee and I. And, uh, Fanny. Have you ever Googled yourself and what's the weirdest thing you've found? Have I ever what? Googled yourself. Oh, have I ever Googled myself? Um, I have Googled myself to find like my fan sites and stuff and there's this one fan site, Savannah Eaton Central High. <laughs> uh, they're super cool and like I'll look on the fan site and there's they post things that I don't even know like <laughs> that's going on. Like they posted about the uh, 
like a show one time and I was like, oh cool, <laughs> I guess I'm performing there. But um, the weirdest thing, I haven't really found anything weird yet. Uh, just like random pictures that I'm like, whoa, where'd they get those? Like with my dance team when I was um, in high school, when I went to public school. And uh, it's just weird how they find all that stuff. But I haven't found anything too weird or anything like that. So you're obviously in the spotlight, so there's going to be like positive uh, gossip and you know negative. How do you deal with that? I try and just um, not worry about it. Like there's some rude comments, of course. There's always going to be rude comments and stuff like on YouTube videos, and I try and just not worry about it. Um, I have my parents and my friends to um, help me get through it, but it doesn't really get to me. I kind of just uh, stay away from like reading all that stuff. Okay. Have you ever been mistaken for somebody else? Yeah, Lo Bosworth um, from The Hills. Actually, MT Buzzworthy was like, Savannah, Lo Bosworth, they look alike. And there's a picture next to us. And I was like, I didn't know I took a picture in that blouse. And it was, it was Lo. So um, I think it's, it's kind of cool. I mean, I love The Hills. So I guess it's a compliment. <laughs> um, if you could be any character from a Disney like animated movie, who would you want to be? Belle. Hands down, Belle. She gets to wear a really cute yellow dress, gown, and uh, she's, she's just awesome. She's my favorite princess. And do you have any advice for any upcoming singers? Yeah, uh, definitely to never give up. Uh, believe in yourself. I mean, if I would have given up a couple years ago, I wouldn't be where I am today. So just um, never give up and uh, just follow your dreams.